Hello, everybody. My name is Rabbi Akiva Feinstein, and I'm the new senior rabbi, director of spiritual living for the Menorah Park campus. I wanted to make this video today to introduce myself to you, give you a chance to see who I am and to see what I'm up to. One of the most important things right now, as we all know, is giving support to our residents during this difficult time. Certainly the COVID pandemic has been very difficult for them with restrictions on going out, restrictions on visitation. It's definitely a time where our residents are under a lot of stress and looking for when this thing is gonna be over. During this time, my department, the spiritual living department, as well as life enrichment, we've really taken upon ourselves to do as much as we could about this particular problem. And the way we've gone about solving this problem has really been twofold. One is a more traditional, old fashioned method, if you may, and one is a more high tech, technological approach to it. I personally feel the most important method is the first one. We've gone beyond ourselves in trying to give to the residents our time, our presence making sure that we make one-on-one -on -one visits with as many residents as possible and as often as possible. We've added extra staff to accommodate the many, many more visits that now that we are going to be doing. We've also talked to one another in an apartment, practicing finding ways to bring encouragement and to bring support to our residents. What type of conversations are helpful? Which ones are not? What do you say when the resident says, I can't do this anymore, I wanna give up? And how do you inspire them? How do you encourage them when they are feeling good as well? So this is the most important thing, is bringing one-on-one, -on -one, bringing people to our residents on the campus. And I really feel that I want every resident to feel that even though they're in a large nursing home with a lot of people, they really have their rabbi. They really have someone to turn to and someone who cares about them in a personal way. But besides that, besides that approach, I do enjoy technology a lot. And I do feel that we can find some of the solutions in technology. We've worked very hard across the campus to find ways to bring programming through the television stations. We've recorded Passover seders, Hanukkah, Hanukkah parties, hamantash and baking. We've we found ways to make exciting programming and bring it to the residents over the television stations that are offered in their, in their rooms across the campus. We've also tried to be creative. We've been approached by schools and by synagogues, and they've said to us, we wanna bring a program. We wanna make a concert. How can we connect to your residents? And using Zoom and other technologies, we've been able to allow them to have 20 different kids playing instruments and to have this particular concert being brought to the, the rooms of our residents here in Menorah Park. We've also had to be creative. We've had parades outside the residents' windows. We've put up beautiful signs outside of the rooms telling them to be happy and smile. Tomorrow's going to be a better day. But on top of all of this, working with our residents and with our staff, one of the most important things that I am going to be working on is the connection with our community. The people who are outside the Menorah Park campus, the people who are in the synagogues, in the organizations, in the churches, the people who are in the community who want to find a way to connect to our residents and reach out to us, I very much want to make that a possibility. I'm beginning already to work with, with more organizations and synagogues, how they can share their programming, how they can share their rabbis, how they can make more of a connection to us in a unique and creative way. And so I really put my name out there that if you want to call me, you want to contact me, you want to be part of what we do at our campus, you want to give us some help at this challenging time, I'm there for you to be the person who can make that connection. So I hope this has been useful and I hope that, you know, God willing, all of these things, all these hopes and these dreams come true. And it's not going to be easy, but with a lot of hard work, a lot of dedication and a lot of faith, I believe that we can get through these challenging times together. And I look forward for my job evolving from the job of being one with how do we handle the restrictions of COVID and these challenges, but to one being when it's all over, how can we make this campus even more special, even more great? How can we bring even more wonderful opportunities to our residents and to our staff? But anyways, thank you to everyone for your support and encouragement. And I look forward to meeting you all personally at a time, hopefully soon.